right, Leah is ready to say I do. Leah, what, yeah, what's, what's going on? You look very pretty. Me and my boyfriend, we've been together for six years. Yes. Engaged for about two. Yep. I mean, we're having a baby in August. Oh, oh. So, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah, how's the relationship going? I it's it's good. I mean, I work two jobs and I go to school, so it gets rough at times. Wow, Just plus it. having a baby. and Yeah. 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 Is this crazy. your first? Yes, for both yeah. of us, yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. great. Good luck Thank to you. you. Thank you. But, yeah, it gets crazy at times because we don't, you know what I mean, we barely see each other, so. Why do you distant. barely see? He saw you once. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Yeah. But I work two, you know what I mean? I work two jobs and go to school, so. Now, does he work? Does he have yeah, a job? Yeah, he has a job. Yeah, so, oh, I see. Do you guys live together? Yeah, we live yeah. together. So it's like whenever I want to come home from work, I just want to go to bed and then wake up and do all over again. Oh. Because I'm just so tired. I see. Okay. But uh, you're here to get married here on the show. I am, I am. Oh, well, great. Yeah. Thanks for inviting us to the wedding. Uh, uh, some of you maybe bought presents, no? Oh, we feel awkward. We didn't know. Okay. It's okay. Okay, so let's, uh, and your fiance's name is Larry. Yes. Here is the groom, Larry. <laughs> Hi, Larry. How you doing, Jay? Nice to see you. Congratulations. Thank you, sir. Beautiful bride, child on the way. Yeah, I'm blessed, man. Yes. Extremely blessed. Well, great. So, uh, everything good? Yeah, yeah, everything's pretty good. Ready to get married? Yeah, just a little busy at times, you know what I mean, yeah. with her schedule. You know what I mean, I can't complain. She's independent, you know what I mean? Yeah. She does her thing. And, she, yeah, she was saying that the schedule is tough because she's got two jobs, goes to school. You have a job. Yeah. I mean, I just want to say, just, like, the way we've been being distanced and stuff, I don't feel like I get the affection I need sometimes. Oh. Uh, so, uh, I was at work the other day, and uh, Amber came in. And, who's, uh, who's Amber? One of my friend's girls. And uh, she hit me up on the book. We started talking a little bit. And we met up at a friend's house after, and I don't know how it happened. We started watching porn on the internet, and we had sex. You, you were here to get married, and a couple of days ago, you had sex with your friend's girlfriend? Yeah, it was like three or four days ago. Oh. I just feel like she deserves to know before, you know what I mean? I, I want to go through with this wedding. I want to go through with having a family. Yeah. I mean, like I said, it's an extreme blessing to me. Um, Why do you have sex with someone else if you, if you love her? I'm going to ask the same question. Yeah. <laughs> just, uh, you know what I mean, with the schedules, the affection's not there. You know what I mean? At the time, I felt like I was getting the affection, you know what I mean, that I was needing. You know what I mean? It's complicated, man. You know what I mean? Just yeah. being busy like that. So just because I get busy means you have to go with somebody else? No, that's not it at all. I mean, it's just bad situation i mean there's no excuse for it you know what i mean i'm a man i'm gonna tell you to your face and i'm gonna apologize to you and i sincerely mean it i don't know if i believe you so do you know this uh amber what's you oh you know amber here's amber Chemistry, like we got along good and we just but hit you know it off. I'm pregnant with this child. Yeah, but honestly, I really don't care about you. Oh. That's so messed up. You don't even understand. Like, I thought we were cool. Um, I mean, we hung out with our boyfriends. Our boyfriends were cool. We aren't friends. You're lucky I'm pregnant or I'd beat your ass, but my sister's here. Okay. Oh. Who's, who's Kayla? That's my sister. Oh, your sister. All right, here's your, here's your sister, Kayla.
you're her sister and you're here. Oh, because she's pregnant and she, yeah, she, she obviously couldn't find. What do you want? Why? Why because are you trying to bring me happy? Like I'm not worried about what she wants. I'm worried about me and my future. Okay, well, she has a baby coming to him. Well, clearly, he wouldn't be with somebody else if he wanted to be married to her. And Do you spread her. your legs for everybody? Do you spread your legs for everybody, or is it just taken, guys? Oh. Um, no. And just because I slept with him doesn't mean that I'm a slut. Yeah, we hit it off. We went out. We hit it off. I mean, well, your feelings need to stop. Because he's taken, he's getting married, he wants to marry Leah. Clearly he doesn't if he's sleeping with somebody else and he already is marrying and having okay. a baby on the way. Uh, and he's admitting that he wants yeah. to be. What do you want to say to him? What we had was nothing serious. I'm I thought sorry. you was giving me the affection I needed. It's kind of a lust thing. That's six years of my life. I love her. We have bond. We got a kid on the way. Okay. That's a blessing. That means the world to me. Yeah, this mistake might you may seem a little crazy, but that's what really matters. What, why weren't you thinking about that? I mean, it was four days ago. Yeah. Clearly, I gave you something that she didn't. So you're saying you won't you won't see her again? No, not, not happen. Fine with me. Oh, so you, you have no attachment to him, you just... I just, we did hit it off, you know, and I felt yeah. like we could maybe be something, but clearly, it's whatever. I mean, no hard feelings. Who's Miguel? Oh. Her, boyfriend. Her boyfriend. Oh, you, you're, oh, okay, here's Miguel. I can't believe it. You might not got accepted. You got to respect it, because I'm here, baby. <laughs> She's going back home. <laughs> you see, on our show, you got to dress up. <laughs> okay, what, what do you want to say to him? Um, well, when you moved me to West Virginia, it was supposed to be different than what it was back home. Since we moved here, you had all these promises that we were going to accomplish our goals, go back to school, get, buy our house, start a new life, and none of that has happened. I'm doing everything I can. That's all I can say. I try to do everything for you. I mean, yeah, we have roommates, so what? We don't got a car? Hey, I put money, I put food on the table. That's all I got to do. Do you love him? Do you want to be with him? I mean, yeah, I just, I just had so much more expectations, and it just feels like he's not trying. Like, I feel like I'm head over heels with him, and then it feels like he could care less if I'm there or not. She's going home, Jerry. It's one time for me. Okay, what's going hap to happen here? What, what do you want to say to him? I just, I feel really disrespected. Oh. Baby, like a He didn't mean nothing. Not a thing. His crowd don't mean nothing. None of these people, that's that kid in your stomach and you and our future. That's it. Yeah. It makes me sad. It makes, it makes you need to take a long, hard time to think about this, Leah, because you don't want to be with somebody who you and as your husband and be in and out of your and your baby's lives. Honestly. I don't think your opinion gets This is me and her at the end of the day. That's right. hey, Period. That's my sister, and I'm there for her no Thank matter you. what. I respect that. 
Right. At the end of the day, it's me and her. That baby's mine regardless. And I will be a better father than my dad was, and I will take care of that baby. And we will see. When that day comes, we will see that. And let's hope for the best. Want to marry him? Yeah. Leah, you are my first love and the love of my life. The past six years has been amazing, and you're the strongest woman I know. And I can't wait to spend the rest of my life with you by my side, and I know you're going to be an amazing mother. And I'm so excited to start this family with you. I promise to always be a positive role model for our baby. I promise that I'll always put you and my baby first. You guys will always be my number one priority. I promise that I won't ever cheat on you again, and you're the only one I want to be with forever. <laughs> I promise to love you and only you no matter what. You are the only woman who matters to me. Baby, I love you with all my heart. Larry, the past six years with you has been a roller coaster, but I wouldn't change it for the world. You're my best friend and soulmate. When you look at me in my eyes, I'll fall more and more in love with you. And when I love when you roll over in your sleep just to feel me next to you. I love the way you pull me in and kiss me, the way you make me laugh and how we pick on each other. I love everything about you and I can't wait to be your wife. We'll be right back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.